Hey, how's it going? Uh, today we're gonna go over how to draw a scary skull. Okay, it's gonna be for Halloween, and that's pretty much it, okay? Simple, for beginners, step by step, all right? It's gonna be very, very fast as well, so let's hop right into it. I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna pull a line down. It's gonna be kind of like that, the top of the eye. I'm gonna go over here, pull up. Curve down. Curve down here for the sides of the eye. Line over here, line over here for that side of the eye, top of the line there, down, down for the nasal cavity, and I'm going to pull up over here. Curve line here, curve line here, cool, cool. So we already have like a, kind of a different looking eye, right? It's not just a square eye of the skull, it's kind of like... It's, it's an angry skull, right? Line over here, line over here. Line forward there, you know, the brow. Uh, cheekbone. Cheekbone. Curve for the top of the skull, and it's gonna go back down here to meet the head there, okay? All righty, then I'm gonna pull a line up the side there because there's a, kind of a, like a hole right there in the, in the side of the head. I'm gonna go right here into the eye and I'm gonna kind of fill in most of it. Not all of it, but most of it. I'm gonna fill it in. To kind of give it a, obviously like a dark shape right there, right? For the shadow. Curve underneath. Curve underneath. Line over here. To fill that in. Curve. Curve line here. Line over here. Curve over here. Pulling a line in right there for the, the, this is called the zygomatic arch. It's kind of bones right here on the right side of the face. Gonna go on this side as well, throw a line here and then fill all this to the right in dark. Don't forget, if you like learning how to draw Halloween, hit the subscribe and click the bell notification. What that's gonna do is it's gonna let you know when I post. And it's going gonna, it's gonna to basically tell you, not this this year, it's going to tell you next year. So, for example, next year also, when Halloween starts rolling around, um, it's, you're going to start seeing cool Halloween videos on your feed, right? Without you having to even uh, subscribe again. So, absolutely do that if you can. There's no downside to it at all. I'm going to pull a line here for the kind of the, the wrinkling of the middle of the head there. Down. Boom, 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 boom. Downward here. And you kind of see the, that, you know, the top part of the, the bone there. Curve, 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 curve for the teeth right there. I'm gonna go over here on this side, down. Fill it in. Curve here. This side over here. Fill in on this side. Line over here. Line over here. And that's just, this darkness is to kind of give it some gravitas, right? Some weight to the design. And that's kind of what you want, right? So at this point, you can kind of do whatever you want. You can throw a little thin line here, thin line here. You can kind of create, a, you know, darker lines here. You can throw in whatever style points you want um, because you already have, you know, the majority of the design already in there. So... I do recommend that you, uh, you know, kind of fool around with this stuff right here. You can throw these little nick marks right here along the edge. You can throw these little dots, right? Kind of like where the teeth are in there in the gum. 
it, you can, uh, there's a lot of flexibility. That's what's kind of cool about it. There's a ton of flexibility in the design that you do. Right? Uh, and at this point, you kind of kind of move things around as at will. What I want you to do, by the way, if you want to learn how to draw in general, like everything and everything, go to the main website, uh, our main website, and that is uh, sketchingeasy.com. Go there. There's a beginner drawing lesson. It'll teach you how to start drawing if you've never drawn anything in your life, hardly. Um, it's going to give you the uh, how to get rid of, like, your sh if you have a shaky hand, let's say pulling, like, a circle, it's going to tell you how to get rid of that. There are these short, free, completely free lessons on the site. Go check that out. It is incredibly worth it. Um, and I think you're going to really enjoy it, okay? So go check that out. All right, that is it. I want to thank you very much. Well, actually, one other thing. You can always add to this skull as well, okay? You can always add the bottom jaw right here if you want with dark. Um, and like I said, the more of these speckled lines here that you add, the more convincing it'll be because it looks like you put more work into it, which is true, right? It looks like you put more time into it um, as long as you don't break it. A couple of things about these speckles over these little dots, the, these lines, they have to be thinner than the other lines. That's what makes them work, okay? They have to be uh, significantly thinner. So just kind of remember that because that's just really going to make... Uh, or break the design. If you make these lines way too thick, it's going to kind of really destroy the entire... Um, it, basically, it's going to destroy the entire design because the, the viewer is not going to know where to look, and that's a big part of this. You want to be able to guide the viewer's eye, right? They want to see the overall image of the, like, dot, dot, like, see the dark, dark. If you squint your eyes, you see dark, 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 huge darks. And then secondary, you start seeing these little uh, spreckled lines, right? So just kind of remember that. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Thank you so much. I will see you in the next video, okay? See you soon. Happy Halloween. Hey, for those of you that are a little bit more serious and you really want to kind of upgrade your art skill all around, uh, I have these beginner art lessons here on my Skillshare. So the idea with this is that some people that, you know, for example, on YouTube, people just kind of want to draw what's in the video and just generally have a fun time. They're not always concerned about the little details and stuff about learning uh, how to do this stuff, you know, long term. Um, and I get that. That's fun. But for some people, some people want to upgrade their art ability entirely, like all around, like they're serious about it. If that's you, go here. Um, like I said, there's programs here on even some of the same material. Like I said, it's just a lot more in depth. My eye drawing program is an hour as opposed to the video I have on YouTube, which is like 10 minutes, right? You can still learn from both. But like I said, if you really want more and you really want to make this part of your life, go here. Um, I have same thing over here, how to draw a dragon head. I have anime. I have cartoons. There's categories for everything and everything is for beginners. Um, the other thing about this website is it's incredibly easy to watch it. This is like the Netflix of like drawing lessons. So you can go through the entire site, see everybody else's lessons. And normally the, the site costs like 30 to 40 bucks a month. Um, because you're watching this video right now, if you're still watching right now, you get it for free for at least a month, like 30 days. That's a lot. Um, but just you, what you have to do is go over here to the video, go down, first link in the description the very very first link that gives you free access to this whole thing for 30 days um, you just go over here you click this thing boom and then you sign up um, and it's super easy and the, the cool part is you can just straight up cancel it before the 30 days is up and you never pay a single thing you never pay a cent and you got all this learning from it uh, but yeah, like I said, that's uh, an option for you guys. Uh, if you guys want to do it, absolutely go hit that up. Um, and that's it.